Ahoy, guys. It is Jack and Jeff from AchievementHunter.com doing Dude. some more Dante's Inferno. Where's the enthusiasm? Ahoy, guys. Oh, yeah. Jack, how's it going? So we're collecting Judas coins. We're going to do one through five. There are 30 in the game, and we're going to show you the first five are. And all five are actually in limbo, which is the first level. So right after you fall into hell, the first time you're walking over these bodies in the wall, which is such a twisted thing. Um, you, can, you can go talk to Virgil here, and he's going to go like, blah, 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 poet, poet, blah, blah, blah. And then up on this ledge here is <laughs> Is your, that his poem? That's <laughs> His most famous It's poem. a haiku. And then uh, up here is your first Judas coin. You see your right bumper, and then tap B a few times, and you're going to get it. Are you, Judas. Oh, there look you go, at 30 that. pieces of silver. So that's number one. What happens when you get all five? When you get five, you actually unlock like 3,000 souls or whatever, which is like your money in the game. Oh. And so... Uh, on this hand crank elevator thing, as you're going along, just keep going all the way to the top instead of just halfway through. Mm -hmm. And then on that left side there is our uh, next little fountain. Yeah. And that's number two. Tucked away right there waiting yeah, for us. Just hidden away. Nestled in the corner. Aww. That's a, Nestled in the corner is the safe place to be, right? Dude, you're about to get 3,000 <laughs> souls. <laughs> that's so got to be exciting. Right before boarding Charon, uh, which is the boat dude, <laughs> around the other side of this little dude who has the sp spike in his back, I guess, is your third one. Sweet. Hooray. And then you climb across. And this one, this one's tricky. I missed this one my first time through, which was a huge pain in my ass. So you're gonna get to this point here where you have to move a box inside of Charon, and then you actually have to uh, jump up to the next little ledge thing. So push this back, and then move uh -huh. your box all the way over onto the left side. And uh, I, you can miss this one. I missed it. I played it through the whole game and was wondering where my last one was. This is actually the last coin I found, and it's uh, right up in here. Oh, there you go. Look at that. So that's actually coin number four. I would have found that. You Would you have? Yeah, totally. God, that, it was such a pain to figure out where that one was. So that yeah. was four. And then our last one, there's uh, there's Charon's head talking to us. If we go left, there's going to be a uh, big dude down here. Mm -hmm. And then once you kill him, you'll uh, you'll you know be free to get this little thing here. And that'll be the last one. Did I ever tell you about the time I went to high school with Charon? Did you? Yeah. That's, that's sweet. We were, I, I, we were acquaintances. I wouldn't say we were friends, <laughs> but we were friendly. So there we go. That's five of 30. We'll have all the rest for you.